welcome back everybody i am the eagle fan i react to music on this channel i do apologize tried to get a whole run of videos out but again it's been kind of a rough going around here so in lieu of that it's actually a monday now as i am recording this I'm going to try to record as many as I can over, say, the next hour. So maybe four, maybe five, depending on how long they go. And then start filtering them out with the low intention of trying to return to a normal schedule. Now with that said, bear with me as I go. Got a nice little treat here. It's a brookie that I made. It's brownie on the bottom, chocolate chip cookie on top. May or may not have a special ingredient in it, but let's not worry about that. You'll figure that out if, if my demeanor changes any over these next several videos. And you'll know the videos by the ones that I'm wearing this shirt. How about, I was going to say, let's get over here, but we haven't even discussed what we're watching today. Oh my God, I am such an amateur at this. I apologize. We are watching, and I'm sorry I don't have the Ellie shirt on. This is going to be Null Positive. Armageddon. Photo Show Live. Whatever that part means. I... Always am intrigued when I hear or see Null Positive. So let's go over there. That little spot. That little mystery. Mysterious spot. Somewhere over here. Let's go there in three, two, one, go. And here we all are. Let's do this. I am ready. Null Positive always makes me smile because she has such a unique voice and can do many things with it. I am intrigued to see where this goes. So let's freaking go. I had no idea where to stop that. She's doing some really good growling in this. That is one of the things I absolutely love about this group. Is that you can go from growling like this to some absolutely 
beautiful songs like Where There's Smoke There's Fire. Sorry, the German title completely vanished from my head right before I said that. And I didn't want to completely butcher it. So because of that, I went with the Americanized version of the title. Let's freaking keep watching this. Okay, that was short and sweet. Let's go over here and talk about it. There we go. That was Armageddon by Null Positive, a photo show live. Some very nice live pictures thrown in there. Now, like the song, I like the group. As I've said before with other things, and I'll say it again now, I am not going to lie to you. Not my favorite of their songs. This, this one seemed to... It didn't seem to cross as many lines of like vocal styles and such. That's the only thing I can think that's that's keeping me from really jumping in on this one. But, still, love the group, want to see them live sometime. It looks like, at this point, I will probably have to figure out a way to get over to Europe so I can make that happen. So, still on a bucket list. God, I'd love to get to, like, Vakken where I could just check off a bunch of these bucket list items in terms of the different groups that I'd like to see and the big one being freaking going to Vakken. <laughs> How awesome would that be? Anyone out there who has been to Vakken, please let me know down below. Let me know what you've seen, what you've done, and how fun and or not it was i know that i am not looking at this through a complete rosy glasses here or set of rosy glasses i understand that you know there's there's negatives to being in a large crowd like that for a long period of time but I would love to do the best I can while I can still do it. And my neck and shoulder are yelling at me right now. That's got to be something that I've got to figure out a way to get through this part thing. Because I want to be able to keep doing things like going to concerts. Right now, my next one up is either, and I forget which of these came first, 
the MM barbecue with Hailstorm and the Warning. Or it is Unleash the Archers and Power Wolf. But there's many more I want to get to. Love Bites has announced an extremely small list of shows. I would so love for them to be somewhere in the area that I could come and watch. Oh, it would be very cool, even though the whole getting there can be a bit of a pain, if they did Pier 17 up in New York. I've only been there one time. Nicest venue I have been to. Outside, overlooking the city, up on a rooftop. Great venue. So that would be very cool. But then again, obviously, my go-to venue is the TLA in Philly. Because it's easy to get into, easy to get out of. And it's a nice small venue where you get a nice up-close view of the show and not a bad location in the house but enough of that no positive want to see them have to see them have you seen them also let me know that below greatly appreciate any feedback whatsoever with that said if you wouldn't mind a like comment, subscribe, and click on that little bell. Ding. If you want to know when I have a new video out, it's always appreciated. Never pressured, though. Thank you guys again. Please be good to each other out there. We need so, so much more of that. It's only just barely gotten into June, and I am sick and tired of seeing all the hateful comments out there. What is wrong with people? What is wrong with people? So that person over there doesn't love a person who you would love. Who freaking cares? Let them live your their own life. You shut the fuck up. And grow the fuck up. Sorry. I don't mean to, to be getting off on a tangent here. And in a bad one after saying. Be good to each other. And here I am yelling. I apologize. It's just. It's just been very frustrating. Just to see. Like I said. All of the hate that comes out. I'm going to stop dealing or dwelling on that and let's move forward here. Thank you guys again. Please. Until next time, everybody. Take care. And keep your eyes to the sky. Hopefully you'll see something amazing. Not something hateful, but something amazing. Until next time. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.